All right, so this reading is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. I'm going to add Venus into it. I'm going to add love into this reading because I'm going to pull some cards for the love reading. Burning Rose Tarot. All right, like and subscribe to my page. All of my decks are pre-shuffled. We're going to go ahead and get into it. Libra, your energy is coming out so hard. You could be battling another Libra. Yeah. <laughs> Yep, I don't know why I just heard young boy and little Dirk, because they're both Libras. Anyways, I'm not going to talk about that. Um, work through your fears. Be scared of Scorpio energy, because we're dealing with it. I keep getting Aries energy. Libra, some of you guys want something to shift so bad with an Aries, and I'm getting... It's probably not going to happen. You don't show this person a real you, and I don't see it happening. Yeah. You and your loved ones are safe. Cancer energy. You could be dealing with this person. Scorpio energy. is time to release negativity. If this is a baby mom or something or a female that you are highly invested in, Libras, you have yet to let this Scorpio go. Whoever this Scorpio is, okay? You haven't let them go. Libra. The sign of Libra. Some of you guys need to really love on yourselves a little bit hard. It's a baby mother, Libra, that you're not letting go. I keep getting cancer energy. I don't know what this is about. A personal issue reaches a resolution. Since it's telling me to keep going, so I'm gonna go. It's a lot of can it's a lot of water. It's a lot of it's a lot of protecting my emotions type of vibe going on here. Okay? Because you're not pulling Pisces. And when you pull a Scorpio and you pull a Cancer, those are the only two water signs that actually have shells to defend themselves. A Scorpio sting and a Cancer, the claw, they can bite. I don't know what the fuck a crab can do, but yeah, you know, they have that. A fish don't really have that power. We're just going to, like, devour your ass as a shark or something. But you're protecting your energy from something, Libra. And I don't know if it's from this person, but all right. See what I'm saying? That's what I thought. Anything else? Look at our water sign. Balance practical. <laughs> Balance spirituality with practicality. All right, so it's every water sign out here. Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio. Cancer and mentally. And then we have... um. <sighs> You're going to have to free fall in something, Libra, okay? What I keep getting, me versus me. All I keep hearing. Aries energy, cardinal sign, Aries energy, your pride, Libra, me versus me. You're battling someone that's just like you. That's, that, that's what I keep getting. I don't know what that's about. You were taught this person, this person learned from you, you learned from this person. Stop it. All right? But this is all about emotions. There's a lot of emotions on um, full moon and Pisces which is a very, very creative energy, high priestess energy. Let's put that out there. High priestess. So you're using your intuition a lot when it comes to your feelings. You're trying to trust your gut when it comes to this. I'm here in love because it's like me and Jay, Beyonce, Jay-Z. They're not perfect, but they're more so like, they're not perfect, but they are an example of what black love should be or love in general. Emperor energy in the reverse. There go that Aries that I was telling about. Hmm. King of Swords in the reverse and the Wheel of Fortune. All right. Okay. So this is what I'm getting from this. Two of Swords. You have no clue if you should spaz out or if you should just be calm. You're not saying anything right now. I feel like you got some stuff boiling up. You're cooking some shit. You're cooking some stuff. The person you're dealing with is extremely intuitive. Libra, you could be dealing with a Pisces. And if you are, I'm telling you, whatever it is. Your ways and your actions. I'm telling you what's going to happen. It's going to leave you stuck. Because this person is 10 steps ahead of the game. Okay? They're happy. 10 of cups. Some of your Libra men are mad because there is a water sign or an Aries individual. Someone with water in their chart that you could not become a family with. Okay? Reason being. Communication was off. You didn't have the power to be a boss at the time. Um, while your person was highly in tune and being all of the spiritual 
queen and aspects and everything they could be you were immature you were you weren't really doing anything for this family which you should be i, I keep getting pisces energy heavy okay you didn't want to take a break the way you it's of me communication if you didn't pour any love into this situation um it was a second thought if it was ever a thought you didn't care if you're a Libra man, you didn't care. And now this person is the only thing on your mind. You feel like you're in a prison. Nine of Wands energy. <laughs> Nine of Wands energy. Queen of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. You feel like you're in a prison. You can't believe you guys aren't in a relationship. You have no clue. You, you can't believe you guys aren't in a relationship. Wow. All you want to do. Now this person is sound like this person will bust up so damn hard that you can't even come and talk to them. It's something about humility. It's something about being humble. Your ego, that's what came out earlier. You have no clue how to be humble. You're not happy. You're not happy because your person didn't stay stuck. They moved forward and went to be single. Your person decided to stay single to focus on their bag and their growth and their abundance. To you, you feel like it's a betrayal. Now, here's the thing. How the fuck do you feel like this, Libra? Okay? Your person has been betrayed by you and decided to focus on their money. Now, they done walked away without a problem and glowed up and found new love and new money and everything. They are focusing on their self. Again, whoa, that popped off and they came up. Yeah, they're focusing on their self. They're not focusing on the love. If you've seen that card at first, it was in the upright. It flew and it came back out in the reverse. This person is not focusing on giving or taking with you. They don't even depend on you anymore. This person changed a lot. This person, <laughs> I bet, whoever you're dealing with, oh, they done had it. They had it. They had it with you. I can't. This person, no, no, no. I'm trying to find a card so I can show you exactly. This person don't went from being a queen of cups to the queen of swords. This person not playing with you. You come at her crazy, she's going to come at you crazier. She's not offering you anything. This person cut you off, Libra. They cut you off. This is what happened. They deaded this situation. All right, my deck is closed. <sighs> Cannot believe I've been talking this long with these readings. This person deaded this situation. Scorpio energy. Pisces cancer, Scorpio energy. Pisces heavy. Unrequited love. It, that's in a reverse shit. Okay. Unrequited love. Because the way I just read it was like it's supposed to be in the upright. It's safe for you to love. Let your friends help you in the reverse. Like, hell no. What an in the reverse. All right. So here's the thing. This person may still keep you. That's what I'm getting. Because I'm like, it's no damn way in hell. Okay. This person may still communicate with you. They're not so down to the point where they're not going to talk to you, okay? It's safe for you to love. Yes, yeah, someone new. Let your friends help you. Mm -mm. And what? It, no. The reason being, this person is keeping you at bay. They have no intentions on being with you. You're not even an option. They have no intentions on being with you. You're going to stay trapped. And this is part of, damn, wait a minute, Libra. This is a part of their plan. Express your love in the reverse. This person don't even have love for you. Why am I getting this? Hold on, wait. Whatever you did to betray this person with that ten of swords, they're not fucking with you no more, Libra. You want them to forgive and learn. They're not doing it. I don't see it. Not at all. What is this? This can be the one for giving that line and give your relationship a chance in reverse. This person is playing 50-50 with you. They're real fickle in this situation. One minute they forgive you, the next minute they don't even fuck with you. Or this is you. Somebody petty. And I mean petty. My neck is closed. Pretty shop. Somebody petty to the point. It's not even fucking fair. You petty. You petty. You petty as shit. You're controlling. Knight of Swords. You want to be happy with this person. You want you want to please this person, but it's the control. You petty. You petty. You want to nurture. You, you want to marry this person. Capricorn Taurus of Virgo energy. 
It's a force, though, because you petty. You make this person not even want to fucking talk to you or date you. You petty, Libra, or somebody else is. Capricorn is a Virgo. This could be the same stuff. Virgo. Ace of Pentacles, High Priestess in the Reverse. You petty. Like, you don't hold nothing. If you get mad at this person, you tell all their secrets. Like, you petty. That's, that's not going to get you nowhere. Libra Aquarius energy, that's you. Five of Pentacle energy, money. Oh, oh, this is going somewhere else. Okay. Okay. I'm getting an artist, I'm getting artistry, I'm getting a record label, I'm getting. Okay, here's the thing. <laughs> I'm really getting young boy. Young boy, it's a lot of record labels that's not going to deal with you. Reason being is because the danger they feel you put behind it. But that's not the case. These people are threatening about how strong you are, how financially capable you are. They don't want to tell you that they're strong. They don't want to tell you. They admire your strength. But they're not going to freely do anything because you already got it. They know that if they book you and they deal with you, Ace of Wands, Ace of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles, that you have to get paid more. 10 10 10 i don't know if it's 10 10 10 uh, damn sure ain't 10,000 this is young boy 10 million 10 10 10 million followers 10 something ace you are the one they don't want you to feel like you're the one they want to play with your mental five of swords empress and energy they want to play with your mental they wanted to just they want to destroy who you are with your mental they want to fuck with your mental so that you can take so you can feel like you're devalued see what i'm saying queen of pentacles in the reverse they want to play with you mentally they're playing with you mentally their strategy is to fuck with you mentally A Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Once you fuck with their mental, there you go. Ten of Cups in the reverse. Don't let them fuck with your mental. My decks are closed. I don't even know how I got that. I don't, I don't even know. I think you were going through this. If you are a young boy and you people are young boy followers, let me tell you. His enemies are trying to play with his mental. Personal resolution. A personal issue reaches a resolution. This is the answer that you need. Okay? They're fucking with your mental. They want you to feel like you're not that nigga. They want you to feel like you're not the shit. And you are. I fell on the floor. Mastery. Master yourself, okay? Fragmented. They want you to be shattered into pieces. But see, you've been, you, they don't know where you come from, young boy. They don't know. They don't know. What they are also unaware of is the wisdom that you carry. Wisdom comes from experience. You can't be wise if you don't have any experience in life. You are getting to a point, young boy, where they're even more threatened because you're not broken. And you have mastered. And you are wise, okay? You need somebody to talk that shit to. You need them to speak it to you, okay? I have no clue why I'm talking to you like this, all right? Black cat. One thing I want to tell you, young boy, because I know that you don't believe this shit, and if you do, because you probably do, with your Pisces moon, you got Pisces somewhere in your chart, young boy. Mm-hmm, you do. You got Pisces somewhere in your chart, and I'm going to go ahead and say this. You're blessed amongst measures. Look at your chart and tell me where that Pisces is. I'm telling you, it's in your moon. People don't know you have it in your moon. That's the thing. They don't know you have it in your mind. People don't know that Pisces is in young boy chart. That's why he's so creative. That's the reason why he can spit that shit out the way he can. Because he's a motherfucking beast. It's a Pisces. It's a Pisces. It's a Pisces in his energy. It's a Pisces. That's why he's the leader. What the fuck? It's Pisces. It's the water. So it just popped out. It keep flying everywhere. Sorry. This just turned into a young boy reading. This shit is bullshit. I did not plan on doing this. Never mind. Trying to see if there's anything else. <laughs> that can't 
of energy keep coming out because young boy right now you need to be nurtured you need to be loved you need to be know that you are loved and you are nurtured neptune pisces energy air gemini libra aquarius yes 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 they're fucking with your mental don't let them do that your mental your mental your mental your mental that's what i keep hearing that's their strategy to play with your mind because you're young you got it baby